Hello everyone, thank you for checking out this video. You are with Coach Jordan from Territory Academy. Right now we are going to be solving this question together. For this lesson, we will mainly be working backwards as well as making use of very simple algebra, the fundamentals, right, as placeholders for some values which we may not be entirely sure of yet. All right, so looking at this question, we are presented with a number sequence that starting from the third number onwards, each number is the sum of the two previous numbers. All right, so the first thing that should come to mind is that, okay, then this must be a Fibonacci sequence because this statement here defines what the Fibonacci sequence must be, right? So instead of giving us the numbers at the start, what they do give us are numbers somewhere down the middle. So the seventh number is 26 and the tenth number here is 110, right? So we should have 10 blanks in total, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So the seventh one is 26 as given, and the tenth one here is 110. So notice that this one's a little bit more challenging because we don't exactly know what these two blanks are supposed to be, what values they must take. And hence, the way to do this is to let the eighth number here be, say, A. And if the 8th number would be A, notice that my ninth number must be the sum of my 7th and 8th number, which would therefore be 26 plus A. All right, and if this was 26 plus A, then the sum of A plus 26 plus A must then give us my next number, which is then 110. All right, so therefore, this is what we can construct. So notice I now have two copies of A and I can subtract both sides by 26, which means that I am left with 84, sorry, not 84, 83. Sorry, it should be 84 here on my right hand side. All right, and if 2A is equals to 84, then A must be equals to 42. All right, so now that we know A is equals to 42, we can then replace any instance of A here with 42 itself. So then 42 plus 26 here will give us 68. All right, now that we have a string of numbers where there are no blanks in between, this is the stage where we can start to work backwards. So here 42 minus 16 would give us, sorry, 42 minus 26 would give us 16, 26 minus 16 would give us 10, 16 minus 10 gives us 6, 10 minus 6 gives us 4. 6 minus 4 gives us 2 and of course 4 minus 2 must give us 2 as well. All right. So just by working backwards all the way, we will then be able to obtain the first number of the number sequence. All right. So therefore the first number as shown above must be equals to 2. So again from the top, first thing we notice is that the question presents us with a Fibonacci sequence, right? And we were initially only given these two values, right? And since we have two blanks in the middle here that we don't exactly know the value of, we let them be A as well as A plus 26, such that we can construct this equation over here, proceed to then find the value of A, and afterwards, it is simply a matter of working backwards all the way towards our very first number of the sequence. We have completed like this lesson. These tutorials, Thank you for watching this video. I hope you have like enjoyed today's lesson. Goodbye and see you again in another lesson.